So in a case like this where the coefficient of x squared is not unity, what do you do? You will divide, divide through, divide through by the coefficient, which is what? 2. So I divide each of the terms of this equation by 2. So it becomes 2x squared all over 2 minus 24x all over 2 plus 40 all over 2 is equal to 0 all over 2. To divide each of these terms by 2. From here, of course, 2 cancels 2. I'm left with x squared minus 24 over 2. That gives you 12x plus 40 over 2. That gives you 20 is being equal to 0 over 2. That gives you 0. So if you observe from this here, um, the coefficient of x squared is now unity. That's 1. So at this point now, I can now factorize. So the idea is this. Before you use factorization method for any quadratic equation, you must first of all ensure that the coefficient of x squared is unity first before you use factorization method. Alright, so if I'm done with this now, what's next? Next up, I'll look for two numbers that will add up to give me minus 2.